Epstein. Toby seems to be on a roll here. He just realized here, you know, A, I didn't like the idea of trying to be attacked, and I'm going to go ahead and, how many points on me again? And let's just say, I hate to say this, but you deal 16 points of damage to her and finish her off. Oh, no. Sorry. Oh, it's a person killing. Oh, how nice. There you go. There's the winner of our first battle, Mr. Tony. Thank you. Thank you very much. All right. Next, who? Let's see. I'm going to try. Let's see who. See who's. That's, who really wants to? Yeah, who really wants? And it's probably not going to stay here the whole time. That's a good question there. Let's see. I want Nekazawa up there. But you see who you want. Tough choice here. What do you think? I see a Sakura back there. I see a Sakura. Come on. No, no, we call Sakura. <laughs> okay, she refuses. The Sasuke says she. No. Okay, wait a minute. We got to roll the dice. I mean, the number is Sasuke, odd number is Sakura, okay? I got a coin. Oh, better yet, a coin. And a Lithuanian coin, just so you know. Yeah. Hits. So what's hits? Heads is a horse. Heads. Horse or spears. And the and we're assigning Sakura to the horse. Spears. <laughs> spears, it's Sasuke. It's Sasuke! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, here we go. <laughs> get, get 25 points again. Let's start for one. Sasuke seems to be a little distraught that he was forced to fight Nekazawa. So Nekazawa gets to go in for the first attack at 9 points of damage. Curse! <laughs> oh, Sasuke seems to have woken up something inside of him. Probably that curse mark Orochimaru gave him. And deals 13 points of damage. <laughs> nice. That's 16 points for Sasuke and 12 hit points left for Nekazawa. Here we go again. 12. Ooh, Nekazawa must have awake. Also got something awakened in her, in him. Uh, oh, you're a lady cosplayer, but I know it's a guy character. So, so it'll be. Eight points. Boom. <laughs> Sasuke's down left to eight, but he's still alive. Thank goodness. Here we go. Oh, yeah. Sasuke, you're going to try to fight back, but somehow Nekazawa uses some dark powers and counterattacks for two points. Okay, Nekazawa has built, has found a hidden rage, and decides to finish off Sasuke. It was yeah! a big point of damage, yeah, and Sasuke only had eight points left. Bye bye Sasuke, go to the go to the go to the go to the go to get some better training, make walk Naruto just waste a hundred filler episodes just to find you. Thank you, thank you very much. <laughs> Next players, who wants it up there? Oh, let's see. Oh, let's see. I got an eager one with the little auto washer up there. Ashawa gets it. I was close. I remember seeing that. Uh, yeah. That's the wrong one. I want that lady Rama up there. Gets the first shot. Rama, you can do six points of damage to him. 
yet. Okay, Oshawa. It's time to get your first battle in here. I know Pokemon Black and White has not really been seen in as many episodes yet. So he finally gets a little attack. It's not the greatest attack because it only does one point of damage. Aww. Aww. was kind of effective. It actually made you slightly, made Rama slightly dizzy and gets a much more powerful attack for ooh, nine points of damage. Fifteen points for Rama and nineteen left for Ottawa. Mm -hmm. Ash Ashwa. Ashwa. I keep thinking, I don't know Ashwa. why. I'm you can think Nijimaru. Nijimaru? Nijimaru. Nijimaru. Okay, the Japanese name sounds good. I like it. I know. Two. Yeah. Rama! I guess you were tired of getting hit by that cute little Pokemon. So you strike back. Unfortunately, it's only two points. <laughs> Try to fight back. There's only one problem. You slip, you fall, and Rama finds a way to get past your defense and hits you for nine more points of damage. <laughs> okay, only eight points left for Ashwa. Oh yeah. Let's just say yeah. Okay. Is that it? Yeah. Okay, this is gonna be fun. Okay. Um, let's just say you try to attack, but all of a sudden Genma Satome comes up, completely distracts the crud out of you, and Ashwa comes back for a thir was it thirteen point damage counter. Wow. What that no, I don't want any more fiancés, please! No! no! Ah! <laughs> okay. Yeah, let's do this. I hate to say this right now. Um, this is the greatest joke. This is a great joke. I love doing it at, at cosplay combat. You are currently at the point where we're now about ready to go. In Zelda reference. A warning. Spoiler. Ding 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 ding. <laughs> and I was right. <laughs> yeah, Ashawat. Yeah, let's see. Are you ready for evolving yet? Because I think you're going to finally knock off Rama. Sorry. <laughs> It was a six-pointer, yeah, and that was more than enough to get rid of the llama. Thank you, winners, Ashwa. All right. Now I remember we saw Hie, who was kind of interested. So bring her up. Now I need someone. Let's see. That guy, the red bandana. Yeah, bring him up there. Yeah, I saw. Him. Yeah, I saw him. Up there. Who's been doing that for quite a bit? There we go. So yeah, there we go. Um, we finally have another try. Yeah, might as well. <laughs> okay. All right. What should we call you, man? Kuragane. Kuragane? Sounds fair. Okay, we like that. Uh, you know what? Smack talk. I like this. You know what this means? I'm going to give a bonus on the first roll because of that smack talk. I'll tell you what the bonus will be. Yeah, it's, well, the original attack was going to be pretty lousy because you only would have hit him for only one point. But you made a great smack top that hurt his price, so I'm going to triple it to three points of damage. Try to attack again, but somehow the words are still stinging, and you can counterattack for a point. 
Show you. Oh God. <laughs>